All right, so today we're on FIFA 22 career mode, trying something different. I'm going to call this series the I simulated the rest of a player's career series. And I know that's a mouthful, but just bear with me. We're going to be trying out Cristiano Ronaldo today. We're going to be simulating the rest of his career in FIFA 22 career mode. Let's see what happens, how he downgrades or upgrades his stats over time and when he eventually retires as well, if he does any transfers to another club. So pretty much... What we're going to do to test it out, I'm just going to be like a club like West Ham to start things off. I might get sacked because when you simulate, you get sacked. But the main focus here is Ronaldo, and we're going to keep tabs on him as the career save progresses. If you do enjoy the video, please leave a like for me and make sure you subscribe for more FIFA 22 videos. Today's video is sponsored by Mule Factory. If you want to get some FIFA coins, check out Mule Factory. The link will be in the description. If you use my code VAPEXFOOT, you also get 5% off. So first things first, we need to go to... The transfer hub, we're going to search for Ronaldo. So this is basically season one, I guess. And let's find him here. We're going to put him on our transfer list just to keep tabs on him. But as you can see with the scouting report, 91 overall, 36 years of age, a striker, 38 million value. You can see athleticism, all in the greens and all that down there in the summary. Besides the defending, mentality 71. Physicals are decent, but they're going down a bit. Acceleration 84, agility 86. I expect that to decrease as he gets older. And the sprint speed is still pretty high. Technicals are pretty good as well. Finishing 95, heading 90. You know, he's still got some great stats. And uh, that's basically it to start things off. We're going to simulate to the end of the season. And we'll see what he's like in Season 2. Alright, so we're at the start of Season 2. Let's check how Ronaldo is going here. We're going to go to the search tab. So there he is. It looks like his overall decreased already, but his value has gone up. A few of his stats look like they've uh, gone down as well, but let's do a full comparison between Season 1 and Season 2 now. All right, so it looks like his overall decreased, and also athleticism went down, technical ability, shooting went down. It's not a dramatic downgrade, but you can sort of see it. He's still at Manchester United, 37 years of age now, but his value, surprisingly, has actually gone up, despite everything else going down. We've got some more stats here in this comparison. So you can see that uh, acceleration has gone down dramatically. Sprint speed gone down. Agility down. Jumping down. Here's another page of stats. So yeah, basically, like I said earlier, it's a downgrade, but it's not that much of a downgrade yet. I expect it to get worse as he gets a little bit older. So we have reached the start of Season 3. Somehow I'm still employed with West Ham. I don't know how. But let's go for Ronaldo here. And let's see. So it looks like... His overall has decreased dramatically already, a three-point downgrade there. 38 years of age, still at Man United, and his value is still pretty strong, you know, despite, uh, you know, his going down. All right, so with the comparison, overall goes from 90 down to 87. The wages are going down as well. Value went down, and uh, athleticism has now decreased. Technical ability, all that kind of stuff there is starting to go down. We've got some more stats here. Acceleration went from 80 down to 74. Sprint speed going down as well. Strength has now gone from 75 down to 69. So the reactions as well have taken a massive hit. You can see that the stats now are going pretty bad. And then we have some more stats here. So the technicals are not too bad still. He still holds up pretty well with the technicals. And uh, yeah, I can't really complain about that. Let's take a look at Season 4's results. All right, so we've hit Season 4, still employed by West Ham. And let's take a look at Ronaldo. Is he still going? Yes, he is. Still playing for United. They're keeping him around. And you can see that the overall has dropped once again. 87 down to 84. The value is higher than last season. How is the value still going up? I don't understand. He's 39 years old now. And you can see that the summary has declined as well. So here is the full comparison. Obviously, 39 years old now. 84 overall. Three-point drop there from uh, 38 to 39 years old there. The value has gone up again by a million. I don't know how. The wage has gone down, and it looks like he's probably doing one-year contracts at the moment. And uh, the summary has gone down a bit as well. If we take a look at the physical stats, you can see they're taking a big hit now. Acceleration down to 70, sprint speed 80, and agility 76. Jumping's still good. He can still jump. The strength has gone down a lot as well, so he's getting weaker. And uh, yeah, the rest of the stats, uh, some are healthy, some not so much. If we take a look at the technicals, they're still very good. 90 finishing, so you can still score some mad goals. 90 finishing there, shot power 94. So these stats are always very good for Ronaldo. They haven't really decreased much. All right, so we reached the end here, June 2025. Still a couple years away in real life, but uh, we'll get there eventually. But it looks like Ronaldo has decided to hang up the boots finally. So let's see, 40 years old, it says retiring end of season. Cannot approach a retiring player. And as you can see, the stats there on the right, 40 years old, still at United. So it looks like he's going to end his career at United in 2025, according to FIFA. All right, so compared to the previous season, 83 overall is where Ronaldo finishes at 40 years old. 
and obviously that was a one point decrease. His value somehow went up again half a million. I don't know where they're getting this valuation from. His wage went down 10k and the athleticism went down, technical ability down, shooting still pretty safe, you know, it hasn't really decreased much, passing down, defending sort of down as well, we've got some more stats here, so acceleration down to 64 now, and the agility is not bad, sprint speed not bad I guess, but yeah, I guess the physicals are going to take more of a hit than the technicals, so let's see what the technicals look like. So Ronaldo at 40 can still bang him in, obviously 88 finishing, still very healthy there, heading went down from 86 to 81, and a long shot still very high, you know. He can still probably play pretty well in the game at 40 years old with those kinds of stats. But he's decided to hang up the boots. Unfortunately, you can't check many stats in career mode for players in terms of uh, season stats. But I did find this for the Premier League. So Ronaldo did 20 appearances and got 10 goals, 2 assists and uh, 1 yellow card. 71 average rating there, which is not bad. But you can see that his uh, appearances did drop as he got older. So this is the final comparison from the start of Season 1 all the way to the end of Season 4. So we've only got a few more years of Ronaldo left according to FIFA 22. But anyway, we're going to go through every stat here. So the height obviously stays the same. He did not change any clubs. He retired at Man United. And uh, he went from 36 years of age to 40. Did not change any positions. And his overall went from 91 down to 83. So about an 8 point downgrade there. His valuation actually went up as the years went by. I don't understand that, but it went up. And uh, his wage went down, and his release clause did not change there. Athleticism went from 84 down to 71. Technical ability went from 86 down to 77. Shooting went from 91 down to 85. Passing went from 81 down to 70. So obviously, he forgot how to pass a ball. And defending went from 26 down to 21. Mentality, 71 down to 69. If we take a look at this page here, so acceleration 84 down to 64, so he lost 20 points there in the acceleration. Agility 86 down to 74, jumping 95 down to 86, strength 77 down to 59, aggression 63 down to 62, interceptions 29 down to 24, vision 76 down to 74, sprint speed 88 down to 79, balance 74 down to 66, stamina 77 down to 69, reactions 94 down to 78, Composure 95 stayed the same, and attacking position stays the same at 90. Actually, no, it didn't. It went down by 5. And in the final stats here, ball control went down from 88 to 82. Dribbling down to 75 from an 88. Free kick accuracy, 84 down to 76. Long passing, 77 down to 64. Long shot stayed the same at 93. Slide tackle went down to 17. Curve, 81 down to 73. Crossing, 87 down to 81. Finishing, 95 down to 88. Heading accuracy, 90 down to 81. Short passing, 80 down to 67. Shot power stays the same. Standing tackle went down to 27. Volleys from 86 down to 63. Wow, could he not lift his leg anymore or something? I don't know. Penalties, 88 stays the same as well. So there we go. Ronaldo has only a few more years left. Going to retire at 40 and still have some decent stats at 40 years old. Let me know what you think. If you did enjoy the video, please leave a like for me. Make sure you subscribe for more FIFA 22 content. And if you need something else to watch, hit the thing in the middle. It'll take you to another FIFA video. I'll see you next time.